it's Johnny Custom Ace R&D. Today we're going to be looking at a couple of uh, pistons that we've got here for a Fiat 850. And this is a real typical piston that we used to get back in the 60s, 70s, and 80s. This was made by Borgo. It was called their Testa Special, which was their 10 to 1 piston. And it was an interesting piece because it had a small little concave section here. had a little bit of a dome. It also had a relief over here for the spark plug which was quite nice. And I've ran these pistons for years, and uh, if I could still get them, I probably still would on a lot of engines, because they work pretty well. Had a 20 millimeter pin, had a 1.75, a 2, and I believe it was a 4 millimeter oil ring on the things, and they worked pretty well. Uh, however, uh, moving up in technology and moving up in time, we're now going to be designing some pistons like this sample here. This is actually for a motorcycle. This is uh, for a Yamaha R6 600cc motorcycle. And you can see it has four valves per cylinder, two intakes and two exhaust. And this is a little different configuration than what I'll be running on the Fiat when I design the uh, piston, but I want to show you some of the advantages of this. This is what's called a forged side relief piston. And it gets its name by having this section of material removed. And you can also see it's what we might also consider a slipper skirt style of piston because it has a very small contact area with the cylinder wall. This piston is rather unique because it only has two piston rings. It has a one millimeter top ring and a 1.5 millimeter oil ring, which is not very much uh, in the way of rings, but it does seal quite well. It doesn't give you quite the longevity that a three ring setup would. But for a performance application, it works just fine. This particular piston also has a 14 millimeter pin, which I'll be increasing this to 17 millimeters, which is a small drop in size from the original 22 millimeter or 20 millimeters rather. And if you take a look at the inside of these pistons, you'll see that the Borgo piston has a fairly large area between the pin bosses, and that this newer style here doesn't have much at all. So that's going to mean that I'm going to have to reduce the width of the connecting rod and I'm also going to have to bush the rod for the smaller pin. I'm not going to go quite to 14 millimeters, but it will go to about 16, maybe 17, probably 17. Anyway, I just wanted you to kind of see what we're doing here at Custom Ace R&D. And this is a new product we'll be developing and having for sale here sometime in the near distant future. If you have any more questions about pistons or piston designs, Please contact me, John Edwards, at Costa Mesa R&D. Hey, we'll see you soon.